Well, hello, this is Gene again on the beautiful Alabama coast. It's 1138. I'm meeting Chuck Howard to have a sandwich. Chuck is a good customer that's become a good friend. And Chuck and I are going to talk about Phoenix West, too, and what's going on. Uh, so let's go in the great escape here and talk with Chuck. I tell you what, if you want a good sandwich and a good bowl of homemade soup, this is a great place to have it. How's the food in this place? It's good. It's, it's good. good. Going in the great escape. See what's going on in here. Looks like you're busy. Well, there's old Chuck right there. He's beating me here. Hey, Chuck. What's going on, fella? Time to eat. Time to eat. Well, Chuck, just tell us what you're doing. And this is Miss Dottie and her crew at the Great Escape, dishing up this fine food. What are we going to eat, Chuck? We're eating across America. Eating across America. That's right. That's right. So let's let's order up. I'm going to do a chicken quesadilla. I've changed my mind. Chicken quesadilla. All right. We've got a great menu here. Great sandwiches. Good place to eat. And an oatmeal cookie. An oatmeal cookie. How about some of that soup? No, I'm going to stick with just the quesadilla today. All right. Let's try it out. I don't know what I'm going to sit here uh, waiting on our great sandwiches from the great gate. Uh, let's go to John up on the building. John's up there in Phoenix West, too. And let's go to John and just see what's going on up there. Hey, John. I know you're hungry, buddy, but Chuck and I are sitting here at the Great Escape, and we need one of those. With ice water and lime lemon. <laughs> We want to know what's going on at Phoenix West, too, right now, John. What's going Gene on? Gene and Chuck, as you can see, we're pouring the concrete here for the shower bay on this west end corner unit on the 28th floor. That wall, along with the columns, are used to hold up the 29th floor. Hope you guys are enjoying a good lunch while we're out here working. Here we go. We're sinking that concrete in there. We'll put the vibrating machine in there to make sure there's no honeycombs or air pockets. This solid foundation. Leon, this is all that's left of the foundation of the 28th floor. Is that right? Yes, sir. That's it. With the, with the exception of your vertical wall that will hold up the 29th floor. Looks like about maybe three bays left. That's right. Three bays. Left. Gene, Chuck, enjoy your lunch. Leon and I and Jerry Kokemore will be up here eating ours. Hey, John, that's great news, buddy. We've got just the last three bays for Chuck. And the point of walls to hold up the 29th floor will be flying the forms next week. Now, you need to come down and see them. That's an amazing it. thing. I'd like to pick up those forms and fly them up to the next floor. You ought to 29th floor. 29th floor. How many floor. do you have to go? We have three after that. Is that right, John? Well, all right, Chuck. This is great. We're going to enjoy our sandwiches. you got an excuse to come down next week. I do. I'll fly down. You know, I'm going to tell you that the building is looking better and better. It's great to see those cranes moving and people working and the big model open sign, uh, people coming in and out. I, I just It's exciting. I, I can't wait to be floating around that lazy river with my one of my two new grandsons. I guess I've told you about that. Yeah, I'm not sure there's enough tape here to, to share with these folks, but uh, well, when the Prolock sandwiches, I'll show you some pictures. Okay, right? well, we'll put the pictures on next time. <laughs> hey, thank you, Chuck. And thank welcome. you, John. And we'll see you later, buddy. And you folks need to come on down. 1-800-221-6180. 1-800-221-6180. See you next time.